is vlog number one for Connections Festival 2018. We are putting on blank. <laughs> so we're going to talk a little bit about yeah. it. <laughs> the first few weeks of rehearsal was very much becoming aware of what each scene was about, reading through them, finding out which ones we liked, finding out which ones we didn't like so much. Um, and we were in quite a a sticky situation as we weren't sure whether we were going to try and create a story or whether we were going to, like Charlie said, do it in like sort of like an ep what was the word you used? Episodic. Episodic approach. There we go. Um, we had a vote on which scenes we wanted to do and the scenes that were the highest in votes, we decided to put them together. We have not yet decided the order of the scenes. Yeah. So we sort of picked our, our favourite scenes, our sort of top 15 scenes and we're going to build from that because we thought that we tried so hard to piece together a story that we sort of got lost in it. Mm -hmm. I think we started to lose what it was really all about. Um, so personally, the first scene, which is Ravita, which I'm in, I think it's a really important scene to go around the basis of absent parents especially because Obviously the entire scene is about the parents not being there and there not being any food in the house and the scene shows us the end product of what happens and how um, it emotionally affects these children. Um, I really like some of the scenes with no dialogue, so such as Smash and um, Dance and some of them scenes because they're really quite ambiguous and they can kind of be like related to any of the stories. So like. They're not directly related to the themes, but easily they can be related and I just think they're really interesting and it's going to be really interesting to see how we do them. I think when I first read it, I really liked the scene Pizza. I felt that was the, I felt that was the only scene which sort of represented uh, a situation where there wasn't necessarily a negative parent involved or the absence of a negative parent. It was, it's more about how a good parent is absent, how they, they've negative situations has caused, caused a good adult um, to become an absent parent which isn't necessarily what a lot of the other scenes touch upon. I also like how you have like subtle scenes like singing it can be very ambiguous and you can take it as any way you want to um, but then you have scenes like hotel which are very obvious and you don't need to be a genius to work out what's happening um, and there's good levels and I think the audience will be engaged with that having moments where they have to think and then moments where they just sort of like sat back in shock at what's being presented to them, so yeah, it's a like good balance, definitely. That contrast between yeah. sort of the comedy and the very se like serious ones. Um, one scene that I really like is Tape. Um, I think Birch has a really good way of, like in her writing, building tension and writing these really like manipulative, horrible characters. And it's just really interesting reading that scene and like watching how everything unfolds, and I think the audiences will really enjoy that. I feel like the casting's been perfect, like some roles are, um, have been given to people that fit them so incredibly well and some are in other people's uh, kind of... Like outside so out, people's yeah. comfort zones. Yeah, outside people's comfort zones and stuff people haven't really done before and that they've been very keen on doing and uh, I feel like that will show in their performances that they've been keen to do a certain thing and like to um, show their like diversity within their acting. We've chosen like a really wide range of scenes and it covers like a lot of different themes and stories but I think that's really good because it means that we're going to be able to share so much more with the audience. Mm. Um, I think we've got a lot more to learn in terms of how we're actually going to bring the play together because all the scenes are separate and we're choosing which scenes to perform and how to put them together so in terms of actual like creating and acting I think with Asa being our director as well, the wonderful man that he is, we're going to have such a good time and we're going to learn so much about performance. Yeah, it's definitely, really it's going to be really good. Not so much something I've learnt, but it's just made me think more about the importance of upbringing with children. Things that I've learnt is like definitely about the like the effects that like, absent parents have on children. Like before this, 
Like I hadn't even really thought about maybe someone who was missing a parent would react the way that they are. In my opinion, it's been I've really struggled to get a grasp of the whole the whole script. Mm. It's been really confusing, but seeing as we've sat down, been researching things and developing a knowledge, then I think it's becoming a lot more clear, isn't it, to, yeah. to what we're doing. The difficulty was obviously choosing it, coming mm. together. Obviously, we all don't think the same, so mm. we're having to come together, think differently, and yeah. manage to pull scenes together. So it's I been think, a tough process. I think that's a positive about the cast as well, because we're all we're all so we're all so opinionated, and we've all got like we're all so passionate about the script. We all clearly love it. It's just sort of because of that, we've all gone away and created our own sort of stories in our heads. But it's. It's nice for Ace to sort of just took us down to reality. He was like, "Look, we need to we need to get this together," and we we sort of just all came to agreement on stuff. We voted for the scenes we liked, and then we're going to work it from there. And that's sort of like the process we're in at the minute. I think it will be a big hit in the chest because we are um developing and showing these ideas as i already said about like absent parents and how detrimental the effect of not having the parents there can be life lessons looking at life in a different way from the outside after seeing the show and seeing how some people how they react can be due to their upbringing and not to judge people not necessarily as much on their actions but also to consider when they do certain things, that certain things happen for a reason.